from the quarterback, and this year he has had phenomenal games, but then he's also struggled at times. Screen to Swope, and he has a first down. Rush. By double digits at halftime. Four-man rush on second and ten. Tannehill sets up the screen, and it goes... Northwestern shows blitz. Here they come on third and ten. And Tannehill beats it to the edge. Tannehill under pressure, somehow spins off a sack, can't escape. Baxter. Well, Bryce McNall, number 51, you're going to see him right here. He's going to come off the edge on the inside. Pat Fitzgerald, a defensive coordinator by nature, a middle linebacker, loves to see. Back on a and side of the 50. Tannehill over the middle, swope. Couldn't... Northwestern plays coverage on third and 17, and that forces the check down to Molina. No place to go downfield with the football. A very difficult month for all these players. And first down. Wachaku has nine yards. Because it should be about these players. That's a backwards pass to Swope. Four-man rush. Tannehill at the first down marker. Finds Swope. Design rollout for Tannehill on third and six. Looks downfield. Swope gets free inside the 50. Swope is his route running ability. Watch this double move. He's going to run a wheel route stop and then up the field. Most impressive of image. Tannehill now looks left. Coming back to make the catch his tailback Ben Molina. He looks that way. To the end zone for Fuller. He makes the catch out of bounds. In front, staying back. That um, might have been a touchdown. Uh, did the left. One off it. Swope gets a block. Stays in bounds. Lost the football. And it looks like a. Tannehill back to throw. Up the seam. In stride. It's dropped. One of the things that we look at as pro prospects is reading coverage. And right here you see. Tannehill reads the coverage and rotation and understands I'm going to signal my receiver to see him touch the shoulder. That's a, a, a signal saying run the skinny post and then you see the accuracy over the linebacker. And second down and ten wide open. Western brings four. Tannehill under some pressure. Comes underneath and that. All right, Reese, thanks very much. Trailing now. Back to the offense. Tannehill uses a stiff arm, gets to the edge, and picks up. He wants to get that monkey off everybody's back. That's a first down kick. On December 23rd, just this past week, a teammate killed in a car crash for AM. and And that's a bobble. Sensio touched the lives of a lot of these players in a very special way. Swope out on the edge. Gets a block downfield. Stays in bounds. Spins to the five. The pile moves and Swope is stopped. Quick screen to watch a coup. And he fights. Molina lost his footing. Show blitz and come out to play a eight man three rush. Tannehill. Fine slope for a first down. Second and ten. Tannehill looking at a blitz. Stands strong and delivers a strike right up the seam. Sam is his composure in the pocket. He stands tall, six foot four. He sees the field well and throws the ball on time with Ryan Tannehill's ability to throw the football from the pocket. Dangerous screen thrown to Swope. In his game. On second down, taking a shot for the end zone. Fuller's got it. And it was a tough drive as well for Mike Bolden. Beat here on the touchdown. He had the face mask earlier in the drive. Six foot four, 200 on the clock. Tannehill takes a shot over the middle, and it's incomplete. Season 52, and right now it would probably be about a 52 to 53 yard field goal where they are. Tannehill can add to it. Slips one to the sideline and uh, recruiting coaches and players. So it's, it's 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 been it's been one thing after another, never a dull moment. Kind of like this play. That looked like some Houston football. <laughs> and, and obviously, you know, poised to win this ball game. 
Fuller, a little wide receiver hitch, and he picks up close to eight yards. Booth, the new head coach of Texas A&M, first and ten. Again, a little smoke screen to the outside to Fuller, and he picks up close to eight. Ryan Tannehill. And they have found a run game with Molina. Tannehill off play action under some pressure. Throws it away. That might be intentional. Drop back. Well, it's pretty clear. We'll draw the line here where the tackle box is. Does he get outside? I don't think he did. And Pat Fitzgerald uh, certainly not happy with that. Here they come. Tannehill to the sideline. Long throw. Hauled in by. He's a junior. Take a look at Wachiku. That, that foot was out of bounds there. It's the left foot came down first, uh, but it doesn't really matter because the penalty will give him a first down either way. And the crown on the helmet right there, that is clearly uh, something that they... Four-man rush. Tannehill sets up the screen. Molina has it. Hit at the 30 and brought down. Buggles, but you see the talent level. Tannehill on a rollout to the sideline, and that should have been intercepted. Footwork, that's what makes pro prospects like, really excited about Tannehill. Quick pass out to Swope, and he gets belt for Northwestern's defense trying to get off the field. They'll rush only three. Tannehill, bomb down the sideline. Incomplete. Over through uh, Northwestern players in this last quarter of their career. Tannehill rolling at the goal line, being chased, floats one downfield, and it is intercepted. Well, that should how bad you want it and Brian Peters who has been the emotional leader of this defense and this team frankly for uh, this entire season goes up and makes a play and what a great way for Northwestern trying to get the football back after they lost the onside kick here comes an all-out blitz Tannehill under throws his man a little pump fake and over the head of Swope They'll throw it again on second down and ten. A little screen over the middle to Molina. Great execution by AM. And Molina's got a first. Especially young quarterbacks. Well, he just snapped the ball with ten on the play clock. A low throw and out of bounds. Four man rush, third and 13. Tannehill to the sideline. He's got a first down completion. Wachaku's going to run a corner route, and it's great anticipation out of the pocket from Ryan Tannehill recognizing the defense seeing Peters over the top and putting that ball right on the money this time Tannehill taking the play clock down to three before sending a screen to the near side to Fuller and Fuller goes Northwestern shows blitz Tannehill looks right now comes down the sideline to Fuller and he makes that play more catches more yards and more touchdowns than any other player and when the game is on the line You've got to give it to your playmakers, and Jeff Fuller does not disappoint for the...